Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. I am back with the very last Dollar Tree haul of the month. I cannot believe tomorrow is September 1st. Absolutely crazy. My name is Elizabeth. My channel name is Chi Town Girl. I hope everyone's having a great day. Every single item in this video, a buck and a coin, a dollar twenty-five. Every single item in this video came from the Wappinger Falls location located on Route 9 in the Hudson Valley. If you're familiar with that area, what a beautiful day here in the Hudson Valley it was. And okay, wow, wow, wow. All right, I'm gonna go right with Halloween first. All right, we have some wooden signs, displays, whatever you'd like to call them. This first decor item is basically Hello Pumpkin. How cute is that? If this is something that you don't like, like the design or anything like that, sand it off and make it your own. The back piece is blank, you can do that. It's got plenty of room to stand on its own because it's pretty thick on the bottom. So I grabbed one of those for decor. And then I've really been loving all the little hey boo and the ghosties and stuff. So I saw this one and I said, how perfect it says hey boo. I've still had absolutely no luck finding any of the ghosts at Target. I've been to every Target around my area and there's just none to be had. So I don't know, I've prayed to the ghost gods. We'll see what happens tomorrow when I'm out and about. All right, the next thing I saw, which was really cute, and this is perfect for if you have a bunch of coworkers or some students, and you know, there's all kinds of rules and regulations about candies and parties now, so you really have to be careful. But these would even be fun as little um, placemats um, right by someone's each table setting. It's four little mini pumpkins. They do actually have a little handle. Actually, let me show you. They have a little handle. So say you just, you know, a little friend or something, you put a few sweets and treats in there and just say, here's your Halloween bucket. I think it's just so cute. You know, I liked it. So I grabbed a pack of those. I then grabbed this pumpkin shaped tea light holder. You could put a tea light in there, whether it be a real one or an imitation one. It's gonna sit right in the back there or just use that for decoration. I thought it was extremely festive. I then picked up two of these. I got one in white. Now these are all made of ceramic. There is plastic covering this because this lid is removable. What a cute little, again, a candy jar or a bowl. I ended up getting a white one and an orange one, the traditional pumpkin color orange. I just think they're very pretty. And again, they're ceramic, so you wanna be careful. All right, a couple more things in Halloween and we're gonna jump into something else. I thought these were super cute. I remember them having these last year. And these are the little wind-up hopping toys in lieu of candy or add it with candy. So you have the wind-up pumpkin. I then, this one I think is my favorite. I don't know, I can't decide which one I like better. The mummy, which you wind up and he walks with his feet. Or they had the Frankenstein one. And the only other one that I saw was this one. Cause I always feel like somebody's watching me. <laughs> and he's got purple little foots and it's a purple eyeball. They had it in green, red, and blue, but I grabbed the pinky purple looking one. All right, also in the Halloween section, I thought these were awesome. And I didn't realize that you got eight in a package until I reread it again. And I was like, wow, now that's a buy. These are car window cleans. And they look like that. You get eight in a package. Let me open one up and show you. So you could put these, it says a car window clean, but it's gonna stick on anything. You could put it anywhere you want, your refrigerator, your cabinets. All right, so here, wait a second. I'm bad, there's not eight in here. How stupid am I? I'm not gonna stop this video because I'm all about keeping it real. It's an eight inch cling, not eight in a package. Wah, wah, wah. All right, it's eight inches. There's the cling. You stick it on your window so it looks like it's popping out at you. I totally flubbed that up. I am so sorry. Let's try this again. Eight inch, one cling. This one is this guy popping out. And that's kind of like what it looks like on the car window right there. Then they had this ghost that says boo. So I grabbed me one of those as well. I really flubbed up um, 
sharing that with you guys. All right, let's try to move on and make this better. Eight bags in a package. These are treat sacks. They're five inches by nine inches. How cute are those? I was just talking the other day. If you want to put a few sweets and treats um, into your kid's lunch or maybe just as a little treat, these are adorable. It's just a smaller sack that looks like that. Roll it down a little, put some grass in there, some Halloween grass in there, put a few treats, turn it up, staple it down, and you've got a cute little sack for somebody. Love it, love it, love it. The other one I picked up simply says trick or treat in purple, and then it has the little ghosties all over it. All right, that's going to do it for Halloweeny. Let's jump over to, I know you guys want to see some more socks, right? Am I like freaking everyone out with socks? <laughs> it's been a sock palooza, right? All right. So these are by Peds. Um, I found some like this about a month ago. You get two in a package. They're Peds Ladies Indulge Your Feet. These are so freaking soft. They really are. So we have a pair here that has polka dots. And then the second pair has all these pretty flowers. They are so soft. So I grabbed me those. You know those are definitely worth more than a buck and a coin. Now, the next couple pairs of socks, four pairs I have to share with you, are from Beverly Hills. I won't go into song and dance. These are knee highs, one pair. These are by the company Beverly Hills, so you know those are more than a buck and a coin. So look at what we have, unicorns and rainbows adorable right not as adorable as cups and donuts how cute are these put these away for christmas put them in a stocking then we have hey good looking and it looks like that again these are by beverly hills don't get me going now i'm gonna have that song in my head last but not least look at how pretty these are aren't those just gorgeous and then it's got the tops are done in black. So, so pretty. All right. And this is not really a sock, but we're just going to show it to you anyways because I had it by my socks. Brand name, Copper Care for your elbows. Helps soothe aches and muscle pains. It is a compression bandage. Well, brace actually. So we're going to open this up and check this out. Because just as it says one size fits most, doesn't mean it does. There's what it looks like. So what you're going to end up doing is slipping this over your arm. And yes, it's supposed to be tight because it's a compression stocking. But you would be amazed at the difference that a compression stocking can make on your body. Whether it be your arms or your legs for circulation problems. My daughter um, has had problems with her legs and her veins since she was just a little kid. And she's only 28, going on 28. So she wears compression stockings and they are a pain in the ass. But she needs them. So these things do really work and they make a difference. So I found one in the elbow. And then I found the one for your ankle. I actually got one of each because these are going to go into my donations with all the socks that I have because, you know, people need more than just socks in their life. All right. The next thing we're going to jump over to is stationery real quick. I found some cool looking pens and these are all made by, hmm. well, it's uh, a Green Buyer brand. For some reason, I was thinking Jot. These are all pens. They all write in black ink and they are all clickable. This first package here has actually some little bees on there. And then there's some flowers on another one. And then bee honeycomb on this one. The glare is not that great. There you go. I also found this one, which is a set of three that also writes in black. What a nice little gift for putting away for a school teacher maybe for Christmas with some writing paper. Then we have this one that's all done in these beautiful dark royal blues with whites and last but not least for those of you that like the simple black and white here we have polka dots crisscross and stripes all right also in the stationery section i found these by jot which i thought were pretty cool and they're envelopes that have pockets in them 
So first of all, you have this slip slidey thing right here that allows you to get in and out of this big envelope. So you have a pocket right there. And then when you open up this top pocket that has the snap, you have another pocket right there. And you basically just have multiple pockets throughout to store your items and envelopes. Now, this is the exact same size as a, a, a large size envelope that you just mail with. So it's nice for keeping those in there to keep them, you know, the water off of there. You just wanna keep everything dry. So they had it in this pink, and then they had it in this black one, which is great because I, I organize my papers like a lot. <clears throat> then they had these, which I thought were super cute. I actually have one very similar to this. They call it a file folder. There's six pockets in here. They're made by Jot. And I keep my coupons because, yeah, I cut coupons and I keep my coupons in here. So it has a snap on the front and then it looks just like that. I organize my store coupons. I keep my receipts in one and I carry one in my purse all the time. This right here has a little set of tabs that they enclose in there to give you to use if you want. They have this one and they had this one. They had many other ones, but these were just the two I chose. And the one that I have in my purse right now is probably three years old and it's still going just fine. All right, let's jump over to kitchen. When I say kitchen, I'm just referring to like where all the baking stuff is. So I picked up the regular aluminum foil that I always get over there, which is the 41, uh, not the 41, the 40 square foot one. Um, it works great. I use it all the time. Then I saw this and I was like, ooh, this is new. I've never seen this at Dollar Tree before. This is copper oven liner, withstands heat up to 500 degrees. It gives you one pack, which is 13 by 15.7 inches. And there it is. So I was like, okay, I definitely have to give this a try. A lot of people say when you cook on copper, it makes a huge difference. So I ended up picking up two packs of these to give them a try. Never seen those at the tree before. Um, staying in with kind of like household and stuff like that. Um, special edition, renews it, birthday cake air freshener, birthday cake. And you know what? It smells like birthday cake. Uh, you get a nice whiff of it through the top. It does smell like birthday cake. How are we done, right? I got two of them, so I put them on the side. Make the house smell yummy. And then let's jump over to car fresheners, air fresheners. Talk about fun stuff. All right, so I'm back in the car section looking for cleaning stuff and I come across all these air fresheners. These are by Driver's Choice, which is basically just Dollar Tree's version of an air freshener. But this one here is an electric guitar. <laughs> How cute is that, right? It is made of plastic and it is so fun. It has a string to hang it in your rear view mirror. Then they had another one, but they had it. Oh, wait, let me tell you the scent. My bad. This one is vanilla scented. Then they have this blue one that is fresh linen scented. So if you have somebody that likes their guitars, totally cool. And then I had myself a good old laugh when I saw these because for those of you that follow me know that I have race cars and one of my cars is a 91 Camaro. And in my 91 Camaro, there is still a cassette player from the, because it's original inside, except for a few things. Um, and there's still a cassette in there that works. So when I saw this, I laughed. This is a cassette and it's lemon scented to hang from your rear view mirror. If that's not a flashback to the 80s, I don't know what is. And then this one here is scented in ocean breeze and it's got the white, uh, the blue on there where this one's got the yellow. I didn't see any other colors, but I'm not saying there weren't. That's just what I saw. And then with the car softener fresheners, this is a three pack and it is hanging air fresheners and the scent is Freesia Mugget Rose Herbal. I don't know if I'm saying that right or not, but I'll try to get, so there's how, what it looks like, but let me bring it in closer. That's what I was trying to read to you. They all independently hang from their own string. So that was cool. And then this I think is the coolest. I got a couple of these because first of all, I love Jelly Bellies. But when I saw these, I was like, oh snap, I need a bunch of these. All right, these are Jelly Belly, brand name. 
This is vanilla scented and it's a Jelly Belly air freshener. This one's kind of hard to see, but it does say right there, Jelly Belly. So I found this one. Then they had this one, which is berry blue and it says Jelly Belly right there. And then the hanger right there. Oh, there's a great shot. You could see it to hang it from your rear view mirror or in a bedroom or something. So then they had that one. And then the third one is Tutti Fruity, and this one's done in pink. These are the only three I saw. Now, if there's more, and I'm keeping my fingers crossed, there must be a green one, there must be a grape one, I'm hoping. But these are the only ones that I saw so far, so keep your eyes open. I did get a couple extra because I'm gonna hang them in other cars as well and probably put one in the trailer too. So I thought that was super fun. All right, where are we at with time? Okay. You know what I'm going to say? I'm going to do it again. I'm going to do it again. All right, everybody, this is going to wrap up. Well, maybe I'll have one more before the end of the month because I still have the rest of the evening. So there might be one more coming at you. Until next time, everyone, thank you so much for watching. New shirt, Labrador with his sunglasses. How cute is that, right? OMG. Until next time, everyone, thank you so much for watching. Bye for now.